All right, hello. So today we are going to go over using the stopwatch. From left to right, the buttons are the split or reset button. We never need to know split, but you will need reset. The middle is the mode button. We won't use this very often either. The most important buttons are start and stop. So we will only use the reset button when we are resetting the timer. If the timer is going, you do not need to touch that. The mode is only needed if the stopwatch is not in the stopwatch actual mode, the chronological timer. If it is in the time or the date, you will need to change the mode and we'll go over that. And then start and stop, you will press once to start and once to stop. So let's practice. So if I am going to time someone, I would press the start button here, start, and it starts timing. To stop, I would simply press stop. That's it. I would um, give the time, and this would be 5.81 seconds, or five seconds and 81 hundredths of a second, but we would read it 5.81, and then we didn't even get to a minute yet. To reset, I would simply push the split reset button once to get it back to zero. Then, again, time, stop, reset. That is it. Now, troubleshooting. So, if you get to the stopwatch and it is on the time, okay, so this reads 427, almost 430, you would hit mode and that would take you back to the stopwatch. Again, start, stop, reset, and that is it.